In this video, we're going to learn how to solve algebraic equations with one variable. In algebra, a variable can be represented by any letter. It can be A, B, C, or most famously known as X. A variable could equal any number. It could be 1, 2, 100, 1000, anything. So for these four questions, we have to solve for the variable. We need to isolate whatever variable are in, are in the question. Let's look at number one. We have to isolate x. So the way we do that is we have to take anything from this side and subtract it to the other side or add it. But in this case, we have to subtract three. So subtract three from both sides. And x equals what is 5 minus 3? That is 2. So x equals 2. Number 2, we have 10 plus b equals 0. So b is on the left side, which means we need to subtract 10 to both sides. We get minus 10, and then 0 minus 10. Of course, this cancels. If we rewrite this, b equals, what is 0 minus 10? Take a, no, a 0 and then subtract it by a number, should be negative. So it's negative 10. So the answer to 2 is b equals negative 10. Okay, so number 3 is a little bit different. We're not adding or subtracting anything. Instead, we have f times a number. So when there's an, a coefficient, 7 is the coefficient here. So when we have a coefficient, we have to divide it. Since this is a whole number, we have to divide both sides by 7. So you get 7 here, and then divide it by 7. 7 divided by 7 cancels, and then we're left with f. So now we got 14 divided by 7. So let's rewrite this. We get f equals, what is 14 divided by 7? It should be 2. So the final answer to number 3 is 4, or not 4, it's F equals 2. <laughs> okay, so number 4 is a little bit more complex. We got some addition going on, and we got some multiplication going on. So we need to isolate A here, but the first thing we have to do is get rid of 7. This is pretty easy. So let's subtract 7 to both sides. And we can rewrite this as many times as we want. We can get um, 2a equals, and then 9 minus 7 equals 2. Next, we need to get rid of 2 somehow. Since it's a coefficient in front of a, we have to divide both sides by 2. So 2 here, 2 cancels, and we're left with a, and then we here, we get a equals 2 divided by 2 equals 1. So for number 4, a equals 1. 